So for today's lesson is about quadratic equation. The general form of a quadratic polynomial is ax squared plus bx plus c, where a should not be equal to 0. The degree of a quadratic polynomial is 2. So what is quadratic equation? An equation as we know always has two sides, and these two sides are equal. When we equate this general form of a quadratic polynomial to zero, we got the general or standard form of a quadratic equation. Remember that a is not equal to zero and the constant a, b, c are real numbers. For instance, 2x squared plus 4x plus 2 equal to zero is a quadratic equation. Comparing it to the standard form ax squared plus bx plus c equal to zero, we got a as 2, b as 4, and c as 2. a is the coefficient of x squared, b is the coefficient of x, while c is the constant. This is called a quadratic equation in variable x. x squared plus 3x plus 5 equal to zero is also a quadratic equation. Negative 4x squared plus 11 equal to 0, 2. Yes, you might not see the x with the power of 1 on this equation, but still, it is a quadratic equation. That's because of the degree of the polynomial on the left is 2. Can you find the value of a, b, and c in each of these cases? Here are the values. For x squared plus 3x plus 5 equal to 0, a is 1, b is 3, while c is 5. For negative 4x squared plus 11 equal to 0, a is negative 4, b is 0, c is 11. Notice that the value of coefficient x in the second case is 0, and that's not a problem at all. The important condition is that a must not be equal to 0. We can say that the quadratic equation is in the form of p of x equal to 0, where p of x is a polynomial of degree 2. Does it have any application in real life? Mervyn, who is an Aita, plans to make a rectangular peche garden with an area of 90 square meter and a length of 9 meter more than its width. If you are Mervyn, how would you make the garden? Imagine that this is the rectangular garden. The area is 90 square meter. If its width is x meters, and based on the condition given, its length will be x plus 9 meters. We all know that in getting the area of a rectangle is length times width. Now, we get x multiplied by quantity x plus 9 is equals to 90. Rewriting this will give us a quadratic equation as x squared plus 9x minus 90 equal to 0. But how we will get the value of x? That's what we will learn for the next video. Thank you for watching!